You know what, Zeus? Between you and the kittens, who are getting so big now, look at you guys! I can't believe how big you've gotten! And you can climb up on the bed all on your own! Oh, you guys are so cute! Oh my goodness! Oh, look at those little tummies and those little ears! Oh, goodness, but as cute as you are, between Zeus, you, my friend, barking at me first thing in the morning, I just need to start letting you out with the other dogs to play in the morning, don't I? But between you and the kittens, I am not getting that much sleep, and we have so much work still to do, Zeus! So much work. I mean it, buddy. We do. Okay, maybe it's mostly me who has most of the work to do. But we're almost done getting this place ready, at least in the main parts, so that we can have the grand opening and start accepting new animals and bring in even more little kitty cats and even more puppies that people can come and try to adopt. But I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be able to do that if I don't get enough sleep. So you know what, kittens? I think today might be a very good day to actually move you guys down to the cattery because you're getting big enough you can you can go be cute adorable kittens in the cattery where kitties belong because yeah you're getting big enough you can start eating some of the like mm, semi-solid foods I'll get you guys some of the little like wet foods and you guys should be okay but what do you think about that Zeus today we should work in the cattery and maybe if you want to go outside I can let you outside because I think Tiff is actually here yeah, look, Tiff is here. So she's here working with the dogs outside. So I think you would enjoy that, Zeus. All right, let's gather up the kittens, and I'm going to take them down to the cattery, and you can play in the backyard if you want, or you can come with us. All right, kitties, let's go. Ah, just look how big this place is. I love this room. Oh, man, Zeus. Okay, buddy, if you're going to stay with me, then just watch out so you don't step on any of the little kittens. You're very good about that, but just make sure you don't. Oh, look at them. Look at them. Everything new to sniff and play with, and I haven't even set the toys up yet. Oh, I don't think you guys are big enough to climb up the big cat tree yet, but I really love our catwalk. Zeus, oh my goodness, buddy. You are such, you are just a hoot. You are a hoot. Don't follow me. I'm just testing this. Oh, look at this. Oh, the cats are going to love this. I just, oh, and the beautiful windows. They're going to be able to look at all the birds. I think there's actually, if I come over here, yeah, once we start getting some birds in the big aviary that we have over here, the cats can just like sit on the ledge and like look out and watch all the birds fly by. Oh, this is such a perfect room. Oh, I better make sure the upstairs door is closed. Good, good. And then the little kitty cat walkways so that they can enjoy climbing around the cattery. Oh, I can't wait to move some like couches up in here. I'm sure the main has like some more cheap couches that we can put up here because really Zeus what people want to do with a kitty is they want to sit down in a comfortable couch and they just want to like have a kitty in their lap and they just want to have the nice happy warm fuzzy kitty just purring away in their lap well, that's what they want buddy boy and with puppies you want to go out in the yard and you want to throw a tennis ball and you want to throw a stick and you want them to chase the stick or take them on a walk but with kitties things are a little bit more laid back and I need some I need some couches for that then Oh, are you, oh, look at you guys. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. Go play. Go play. Come on. Woo, now you're really going to play. Okay. But, oh, okay. What you guys doing? What you guys doing? Oh my goodness, they're just rushing all over the place. But we better start unpacking some of these crates, Zeus. If we're going to keep the kittens in here, we need to make sure that they have all the things they need. Like scratching posts. Oh my gosh, look at the scratching posts, Zeus. Oh my goodness. Okay, where am I going to put this? Um, um. Um, right there. Oh, it's a scratching post for the kitties. Oh, they're gonna love that. Kitties, you guys are so lucky. Oh my gosh. And here's where all the pet food is. The lifetime supply of pet food. I hear it's supplied by Two Paws Doggy Bakery. Did you hear that, Zeus? Apparently it's uh, some really awesome gourmet pet food area out in some world area called Zudesia. So that's pretty cool that they're donating all of this pet food. Okay, let's see. Um, I should be able to store it in here. Yeah, there's gonna be plenty of room to store this pet food so let's go ahead and gather it up so much of it armfuls and armfuls of pet food this is fantastic we'll be able to feed all of the kitties for so long I'm not gonna have to worry about that I am however gonna have to worry about getting the right kind of pet food for the kittens because the kittens are still little and I can start transitioning them onto some of the food but they still need some formula so Hmm. In fact, really, what would be best for the kittens, believe it or not, Zeus, is if I could get them goat milk. I know that sounds odd, but goat milk is a very complete healthy food, and uh, actually orphaned kitties are recommended to, to eat some of it. So, little kitty kitties, I'm going to try to see. Oh, whoop. They're just like, woo. Okay. You guys get excited about life, don't you? Okay. I hope you guys are having fun. 
Oh my goodness, maybe if I put more toys out, they'll, they'll like be able to play with the toys. All right, so we've got the scratching post. I don't think I need to put all the scratching posts down right now, but I think a few more would be a good idea. Maybe one over there, maybe one over here. Let's put a couple upstairs. Then we can put the rest away in the shelves. Um, like maybe one right here. I could see a kitty sitting on top of it and staring, hey Zeus boy, and staring at all the birds that are out there. So we'll put one there. We'll put one here. Um, let's see, maybe one right over here. There we go. And then I'm going to put the rest of them away, Zeus. Because that's a lot of kitty cat scratching posts. But hopefully they'll learn how to use the scratching post and not like scratch the wrong things. Like people stuff. <gasps> the kittens are playing! Oh, this is so exciting. All right, so that's everything out of that crate. Okay, that one's empty. Oh, good, and then here's some food dishes. Okay, I bet we don't need to put all of these down right now, but let's go ahead. Um, can I get these crates out of the way? Try to dismantle them, collapse them like a little box. Are they gonna do anything? Zeus, I don't think they're gonna do anything. I'm gonna have to, oh, 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 Zeus, they did something. I thought I was gonna have to ask the mayor for like a special hammer or something to get rid of these, but they're they're falling apart, okay. All right, there we go. All right, let's put down the little food dish. Oh, yay, okay, good, 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 good. There's gonna be plenty of kitty cat food. Um, Let's see, watch out little kitties. Oh my gosh, they're so cute, Zeus. Oh, the cattery is gonna get put together. We can hold so many cats in here too. I can't wait till we start getting more kitties in here, Zeus. Just make sure you don't step on them. You're kind of a big dog, you know? Actually, you always act like you don't know you're a big dog. He's just a big fluffy puppy. All right, there we go. All right, and then we'll put down, I think, a couple cat food bowls right there. So the kitties know there's more food there. And then let's see, there's more cat food. Oh, the ever essential litter box. So I'm gonna just like casually, can I tuck this thing over here? Yeah, there we go. Setting up the litter boxes, so important. All right, can I put another one over here? Like maybe right there, Oop. okay, I kind of messed it up, Zeus. I kind of messed it up. Um, we're gonna leave it there for now. Okay, so the litter boxes, we can line up. Zeus, stay out of the litter boxes. That is not where, that's not where puppies are allowed to play, mind you. Um, okay, and uh, whoop, 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 okay. And I will mess around with the litter boxes later because I need to, <laughs> I need to get them to line up properly. But at least we got them down. And we have little catnip mouses. Oh my gosh, I think the kittens are gonna love playing with this. I really need to see if the mayor has a budget so we can get some feather dangles because all the kitties love feather dangles. <gasps> Look at the little catnip mouse. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. We should sell these. I need to figure out how to make these, Zeus, and then we could sell them as like extra, extra funds so that we could bring more things into the sanctuary. Oh my gosh, look at the little kittens. You guys are so cute. Oh, they're adorable. All right, let's see what else we have in here. Hmm, is someone here? Oh, oh it's Terry and Harmony. Oh, hi, you two. Are you guys just like stopping by to see how the, the sanctuary is going? Oh, it's, it's really nice to see you. Good morning. Siri, hello. I hope you don't mind us stopping by. I brought cookies. Oh, yummy cookies. Thank you so much, Harmony. Oh, you're so nice and sweet. It's just, oh, it's so awesome to have a neighbor like you already. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Good. I was hoping you'd enjoy a nice treat. The mayor mentioned how busy you are lately, taking care of the many new animals already. And, oh my, are those kittens? <laughs> yes, they're actually orphan little baby kittens. The mayor and I found them in a box on the front door. Would you believe that? But they're really cute and they're they're doing really well. Aren't they just, oh, I love kittens. Aren't they just so cute? Her eyes well up with tears immediately. Oh my gosh, orphaned baby kittens? That is just, that is, it's just so sad and, and they're so cute. It's so cute and sad all at once. Oh, I can't help it, please. Can I hold them? <laughs> <laughs> of course, Harmony. Come on in. You and Terry, come on in. You can come play with the kittens. Mm, cookies! Thank you so much, Harmony. Oh, this is this is just wonderful. It's the perfect little pick-me-up snack while we are busy unpacking all these crates and getting the adoption center just ready so that we can have lots of people come in and look at the little itty-bitty kitties and some of the puppies and oh, just who knows what other animals are going to be showing up here pretty soon. So, ah, oh, thank you. Are you are you having fun with the kittens? 
They're just so cute and so precious and so tiny. I can't believe someone would just have tossed these little ones out to fend for themselves. They're still so small. Oh, I'm so glad the sanctuary is here. This is why the mayor wanted to build it, to take care of the little ones who need someone to look after, look out for them. I'm so glad you're here, Siri. Oh, look at those little toes and these little whiskers. Oh, and this little nose. It's just so cute. <laughs> they are pretty cute, but but Harmony, I, I I take it you um you really like cats then? Oh, I love cats, kittens especially. They're just ah, uh, they're just so adorable. But Jason is terribly allergic to them, so we can't keep any in the house. Ah well, at least I can come visit the cats here. I mean, um, may I visit the cats here? <laughs> of course, Harmony. It's actually really great just to visit with the cats because that'll get them used to being around people and especially when you bring Terry, that'll get them used to being around kids and that means that they'll have an even better chance at finding a new home that they can go on to. So that's just, it's perfectly fine, Harmony. Oh, thank you. I'd love to bring Terry by to visit with all the animals. It'd be a wonderful educational experience for him. Not to mention so much fun. Oh, but look at this little kitten belly. It's so adorably chubby. I take it they're eating well for you, Siri? <laughs> they actually are. I've been feeding them formula that the mayor had stocked in our exam room. But you know, now that you mention it, I am trying to transition them onto some of the new, like, wet and solid food. And we have a lot of solid food, and I think they could probably eat it if I just had something like, like milk or goat's milk that I could put into the food. I was just telling Zeus, actually, that, believe it or not, Harmony, did you know that goat's milk is really good for cats and dogs? It has to be raw goat's milk, mind you, but it's, like, super healthy for them. And if I just had some of that to mix in with the cat food, then I might be able to get the kittens to start eating their hard food. Hmm. Goat's milk? Oh, that's easy. Just go ask Lex. Um, who's Lex? Oh my, I'm sorry. I forget how busy you've been in the sanctuary since you got here. Lex runs the grocery store in town, and he is obsessed with goats. Or more, his whole family is. We used to have quite the wild goat problem here in town, but Lex and his family adopted so many of them that now the mayor can grow his roses in peace. But as a result, you can get goat's milk and goat's cheese by the bucket at the grocery store for very cheap. Why don't you run up and ask him for some? I'm sure he'd be happy happy to give you some for the kittens. I mean, who could resist these adorable little whiskers? <laughs> you know what, Harmony? Uh, that's, thank you. I think that's a really good idea, actually. I didn't know that there was, like, goat's milk just here in town. I really haven't left the sanctuary for very long. Zeus and I have just been, I mean, working on getting everything unpacked, and then the kittens just need so much attention. But if you don't mind, like, staying here and just maybe keeping an eye on them or just making sure the doors are closed if you happen to go out, and that would be awesome. So, Zeus, what do you say? We should go take a walk up at the grocery store. Oh, and Terry. Hi, Terry. Are you having fun with the little kittens are you having fun in here kitties kitties meow <laughs> i think he's having a good time look at him and he seems to be pretty good with the animals too so yeah thanks harmony really I, I don't think that'll take us very long come on zeus let's go walk up to the grocery store and we'll go see if there's any goat's milk for the kittens <laughs> are you ready zeus are you ready oh it actually feels really good i love our sanctuary don't get me wrong but it actually feels really good just to be outside for a second we haven't had any time just to see the new town that we live in how silly is that we've really oh we just need to take a look around one day and be able to look at all the little shops and be able to maybe greet some more of our neighbors i mean it's a small town so we should really get to know everybody but hopefully i wonder if harmony would be willing to be a cat volunteer between tiffany and in harmony we just might be able to get enough people here that we can leave the shelter occasionally uh, all right well let's go up there I'm pretty sure that's the grocery store if I remember correctly and it's not a long walk at all it's just right up here past this adorable little fountain good boy Zeus oh, oh look at these delicious apples it just makes my mouth water oh my gosh all this food I'm so glad harmony brought us some cookies but man we've really been living kind of simply Zeus oh We'll have to come by and maybe, oh, the fruit salad. Oh, that looks amazing. And more apples. Oh, mm, we're going to have to stop by here, Zeus. Okay, you be good. If you want to come in, you have to behave yourself. No jumping on any of the, uh, the products or anything like that. Oh, wow. Oh, there's so many candies. Zeus, there's so much candy and cake. Look at how delicious that all looks. Oh, and there's some little spices so I could do some cooking. Oh, it looks like there's cheese sections. Oh, my gosh. Look at all this. There's rice. 
Oh, so many breads and flowers, jams, jellies, condiments. Oh my gosh, pizza, corn on the cob, pie, honey, sausage links. There's so much food here. There's so much food. Okay, okay. All right, Zeus, be a good boy and stay outside. All right, well, I, I might as well just, just come up and ask. So, um, hello, are you Grocery Lex? Um, I'm here, just, I'm trying to find some things. You have a really awesome store. I'm really glad to be in it. Do you, do you have just a moment? Hey there, stranger. What can I do to help you with today? <laughs> do you do you happen to have any goat's milk? I'm looking for it for um goat's milk? Do I ever? I have some of the best goat's milk in the surrounding counties. My nan and nannies have won prize after prize for our delicious goat milk and goat cheese. Just last spring, we won the grand prize blue ribbon and best original aged feta. Ha! I'll bet our fame is what brought you here to our small town today just to try a bite of our fabled cheeses, eh? Um... <laughs> Oh, wow. Um, no, not really. Like, I mean, it sounds really great, but I'm actually, I need some goat milk for some kittens. He blinks in confusion. Kittens? <laughs> yes, I, I run the sanctuary and we've got some baby kittens. The sanctuary? Ah, welcome, neighbor. Ha! Huh. Why didn't you say so in the first place? So you're the new talent the mayor managed to rustle up to run that huge building, eh? Well, don't look so b well, you don't look so bad, especially if you're coming for some of the good stuff. Like I said, my goats produce some of the best milk around. You'll need some for the kittens, eh? Well, that is a first, but I'm pretty sure that this stuff can cure everything from the common cold to a broken heart. So why not hungry kittens, too? I had no idea you already had cats knocking around that place, either. Woo, the mayor must be keeping you busy. Say, you haven't got any goats in that big old barn of yours yet, do you? <laughs> We've got lots of great dogs, but um, no, we don't have any goats yet. I've, I heard you guys used to have a wild goat problem, but I haven't really stumbled on any yet. Um, but if I find some, do you, do you want me to let you know? Like, if I find one? Let me know? Of course I do! Really, my nan and I should be the first to know. Front line in the project to rescue goats from all over. That'd be us. Nan's my wife, you see. And we have a bit of a thing for goats. And kids and kids. Ha! Huh. Meaning our kids and the goat kids. See what I did there? We've got lots of both of them, you see. Love them all. Can't wait to add more to the family. Rowdy, loud, endlessly hungry. Kids and kids. They'll keep you on your toes, but what a life to live. I love it. Ha! <laughs> Anyway, here, let me get you some samples of our finest, healthiest goat milk so you can take them back to your little meows. What's your name, anyway? I go by Lex, and you'll find me here most days, manning the family shop. <laughs> I am Siri, Lex, and thank you. Oh, that'd be so awesome if I could get some samples. And Wow, your family, you guys really love goats and kids, huh? Kids and kids. I, I, I see, yeah, I see what you did there. Uh, but yeah, I'm Siri. It's very nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Siri. Well, what a meeting. It's great to see you. I've been wondering who the mayor got to run this that place. I take it you'll be seeing more of me, eh? Well, I'll let Nan know that we've got to start ordering up some milk for kittens. Ha! Huh, she'll love that. And don't forget to stop by for some food for yourself either. We've got some great snickerdoodle cookies that my eldest kids are learning how to make. His voice drops to a whisper. They aren't very good, though. <laughs> Well, thank you so much, Lex. That'd be awesome. I would, I would love to get those samples. That would be, that would be really amazing. Oh my gosh! And I guess that's the, um, the questionable snickerdoodle cookie, huh? Well, ooh, oh, all right. Well, maybe, maybe another day. Whew, that was actually a lot of fun, Zeus. Ah, oh, you know what? Oh, look at this. Like some samples of the fresh goat milk. I bet the kittens are gonna love this mixed with their hard food. They will probably be eating that stuff up in no time. Oh, and just to get out, wow, I mean, and there's somebody over there in the cafe, but, I mean, we really need to get back to the sanctuary right now. But you know what, Zeus? I think we're going to have so much fun living in this town. They're really awesome people, and everyone seems so friendly and kind and helpful. Oh, I just, I just can't wait to see what adventures we get up to next, buddy.